Hello, this weekend the Earth and Solar System team are at Blue Dot Festival in Jodrell Bank in Cheshire. So behind me is the iconic Lovell Telescope. So back in 1969, uh, working with NASA, Sir Bernard Lovell and the Jodrell Bank team used the Lovell Telescope to pick up signals from the Apollo 11 mission. Uh, so my favourite meteorite is Allende and that's because, I don't know if you can see, but it contains these like white splodges and they're called calcium aluminium inclusions and they're actually the oldest things we have. They're dated to be 4.56 billion years old and they're thought to be the first solids that condensed out of the solar nebula. So these are the first things that formed in our solar system, which is pretty cool to be able to hold. Hello, uh, this is my favourite meteorite and it's called Semchan. And it's really pretty because it's got these beautiful iron crystals on the inside, which you can maybe see if you can zoom in later. And this is a nice example of a, a meteorite that's come from the core of a big asteroid that was destroyed long ago and it's been flying around the solar system that comes down. And these, uh, these crystals form, they only form in meteorites because they take many millions of years to grow as, a, as the iron slowly cools down over time. We've been doing some experiments this weekend all about volcanoes. Um, so one of the ones that I'll show you now, this is our mantle in a bottle. So the earth structure is split into the core, the mantle and the crust, which is what we're stood on now. And this experiment is something that you can do at home. So this is water with red food coloring in, and then this is oil on top. And the earth's mantle convects, which means that the layers mix up together. And we can show this by dropping an Alka-Seltzer into the bottle here. So as the Alka-Seltzer starts to fizz, bubbles start to rise up from the water and convect into the oil, just like the Earth's mantle does. Mm -hmm. 